I'm Owen Marshall. Are you ready for some crazy adventures in the wilderness? Welcome to the wilderness. Oh, oh missed it. Today we're looking for any type of raccoon. Now signs of raccoon, raccoon traps, raccoon poop. Now this is deer poop. And what we're looking for is raccoon poop. It's very different from here's a good mud pile. Now check if any footprints or you know fur has got stuck in spider webs or Oh, look at this. Look at that. That is raccoon tracks. You can see their claws digging into the mud. Now that, that is just beautiful. And now that we've found some footprints, we're looking for any other sign of raccoons. Poo, any fur. Now, come up here. Find some. Right and it is fresh, as you can tell, because it's wet and squishy, and you can actually see he's eating a few berries here. And that, and that, that's definitely fresh. Oh yeah! Oh, take a whiff of that. It's, it's real, real. That, that's a sign of raccoon. So he must have gone this way. And the footprints and the poo. He's another sign of raccoon. This is fur. This is white tufts of fur. Now that is a sign of raccoon, definitely. The black and white stripes. I'll just be walking through, get caught on some sticks, and that's a sign. And you also see some footprints here. The moss has been squished down here, here. It's, it's a sign. Let's keep heading that way. Just some on the bed first. Poor thing. Looks like it's been killed by some kind of animal. Look. It was killed by a raccoon, it looks like. It's a good sign. It's not a good sign for the bird. Isn't she a beauty? But you might not have known about me, because I'm really good at animal calls. So, we're looking for a raccoon, so I'm going to do a raccoon call. <coughs> Hopefully that should bring the attention of the raccoon. Look at this. And after we found the tracks, the poo, the fur, and then the dead bird, which a raccoon probably killed, here's, we're looking for the den. Now this is not all raccoon den it's way too small to be a raccoon den but this is like some small rodent like mouse vole mole now looking for the den oh here's another one right here now that's that's another hole now these these voles and mice burrow down everywhere so now we're just going to look for the dens, the raccoon dens, and then we're going to find a raccoon for sure. Now all the clues, the footprints, the poo, the fur, the dens, the dead bird, has all leaded us to this area. Now there's got to be a raccoon den somewhere. Are they up there? Oh, it doesn't look like it. Maybe down there. Oh, here it is. Look at that. That is big enough for a raccoon to fit in. Just kidding. No, it's too bad we didn't find any raccoons today. But maybe in the next episode, we'll find some raccoons. Thank you for joining me on this amazing adventure to find a raccoon. Unfortunately, we didn't find a raccoon, but we did find lots of signs. Please join me on the next adventure of The Wilderness Show. Now, today... Oh! Oh! Uh, you might not have known about me, 
so I'm really good at animal birds. Here's one myself. Go, 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 go! <laughs> go, 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 go! <laughs> you might not have known about me, is I'm really good at calling animals. Here's one of my calls for a raccoon. <laughs> for any sign of raccoon. Cut. So as you know, we're looking for raccoon poo. Cut. 